What's up, fire signs, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius? We are here for a different type of reading, okay? So I'm going to be doing a warning messages reading um, for uh, each elemental group of fire signs, uh, earth signs, air signs, and water signs. All right, uh, so this is one of the readings that I do offer in all of the options to book a reading with me. It's a warning message reading, okay, which includes a uh, love, uh, money, love, and spiritual warning messages, all right? Now, I'm going to be offering these readings for a discounted price. I'm going to be doing them for $25, but it's only going to be for a limited time only, all right? So you guys, uh, you know, book that, okay, while it's still active. All right, my contact information is in the description box down below, as well as all the spiritual businesses that I support. They will be in the pinned comment in the comment section. So Aries, Leo, and Siege, all right? Let's go ahead and get y'all going. Excuse me, like I said, only the warning readings are the ones that I'm doing for a discounted price. And like I said, that's going to be $25, all right? Excuse me. Sorry, baby. All right, y'all, so... Men, y'all coming out already, King of Wands. I'm not going to be pulling no uh, Oracle messages because I'm just going to pull from the deck because, you know, I can do that. All right, so uh, King of Wands, men, y'all already coming out. So first thing that uh, I feel like could be coming to mind is make sure you're, you're having confidence in yourself during this time. Uh, Leo, Aries, and Sag men. Leo specifically, strength card and the king of wands. Some of y'all might know it's time for you to get active, okay? Like you might need to uh, work in some sort of workout routine. Uh, just go outside, all right? Uh, you, you see how, you know, they kind of end up mountains or on some sort of trail. Uh, y'all can't tell, but this person look old in the face. So I don't know if y'all are older or you're starting to feel old. You know, your bones are snap, crack a pop, rice krispies whenever you wake up in the morning. It's like, I, I'm not a fan of this. Okay, so Leo man, specifically, you might need to make sure that you are uh, being active during this time. All right, the men coming out, damn, all right, hold on. Spirit guys, give me some uh, warning messages that all fire signs need to be ready for during this time or need to hear. Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Okay. Page of Swords, Three of Wands. So Aries, uh, Aries and Leo, y'all showed up already. Um, now, remind, uh, mind you, now I'm going to be doing this reading a little bit differently because I'm doing it for like a collective whenever it comes to, uh, you know, all the fire signs. But my readings, the personal reading that you book with me for the warning reading, it includes money, love, and spiritual warning messages, okay? So, remember that. All right, so Aries um, and Leo, y'all have shown up, but Aries, you here. Page of Swords and the Three of Wands. Some of y'all need to uh, be aware that there are some people uh, watching you during this time. Strangers, people that you know, people who you have moved away from. Strangers, okay? Some of y'all need to be uh, aware of that. Uh, three of Wands. Some of y'all need to make sure that you're closing your windows. Closing your windows. Lock your windows and close your doors. Be smalls. Leo and Aries, like I said. So, Leo, Aries, y'all do need to be careful that people are watching you. Please be aware of your surroundings during this time. I mean, she in a bathroom and her hair uh, tied up. And there's like a man walking by. I mean, he just a mailman, but her, her blinds all open. Kid, and all she got on is that robe. So, some of y'all need to be careful that you're not just walking by your window with nothing on. All right? Especially during the daytime. Um... Eight of Cups is here. So some of y'all, like I said, are also being watched by people who you have walked away from. But some of you guys, it's a specific person. It could be an air sign. Aquarius energy is heavy here. Leo, if it's an air sign, it's somebody who you got on block. Like, you don't even want to deal with this person. Some of y'all, it could be an air sign masculine. Um, this person watch you like hell. I don't know why. Somebody that they know, uh, somebody that they cool with watch you too. All right, they homeboy. <laughs> it's a fit. King of Swords is here. It's an air sign mask and that y'all walked away from that you don't deal with, you don't want to deal with. Leo, this is uh, specifically for y'all. You don't want no parts of that, okay? This person still tuned in to you, kid. It can be any air sign because the Page of Swords is here, but shit. It could be specifically in Aquarius, but I feel like it can be any air sign. Aries, you out here too. So the first card coming out for your morning read is Page of Swords. Watch your surroundings. Be mindful that you are being watched. I just heard some of y'all being monitored. Some of y'all might have a bracelet. <laughs> Some of y'all might have, you know, a little jewelry around the ankle. Okay? Uh, I don't know. You... If that's not you, 
okay, some of y'all are being monitored during this time. I don't know what the fuck that means. You do. Aries Leo. Spirit guys, give me some warnings that all fire signs need to hear during this time or be prepared for. Aries Leo and Sagittarius in the year 2021. Girl, that's kind of broad, ain't it? <laughs> I'm like, wait a minute, girl. It's going to be my later one this year, girl. Listen, okay, the lovers, Gemini energy. I told you it can be any air sign, all right? Eight of Pentacles. Some of y'all, this is somebody. Some of y'all, this is somebody you used to work with. Eight of Pentacles and the Eight of Cups. Some of y'all, this is someone who you used to work with. Um, you could have quit a job. Somebody who you used to work with at that job, keeping tabs on you, shorty. All right? Some of you guys, this is somebody who you dated from the job, girl. Y'all heard my past experiences, okay? <laughs> I shouldn't have done it, okay? I shouldn't have done it. 555. So, some of y'all, uh, like I said, uh, somebody who you used to work with is still keeping tabs on you. Some of y'all need to be careful because your job could be monitoring your social media during this time. Somebody at your job, like a supervisor, some shit. Some of y'all, there's a supervisor that's watching your social media. Be careful about what you be posting. I mean, if you don't give a fuck, you don't give a fuck, okay? But some of y'all might need to block. Seven of Wands came out deal. You might need to block a, a certain person at your job. If you have a feeling or they shit pop up in the people you may know, block the motherfucker. If you don't want them in your business, like D at, all right? Um, others, like I said, this is somebody who you used to live with, somebody who you used to date. It could most definitely be an air sign, y'all. Maybe an earth sign. Don't you somebody who you used to date, girl? Two of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles. I said Queen of Pentacles and that's the eight, but I said that because the Queen of Pentacles is right here. So some of you guys, like I said, this could be somebody who you used to uh, date. Cancer and Virgo is here heavy, all right? But so is Gemini. Me and y'all, I'm talking to y'all too. You could have, uh, this could be a, um, a earth sign feminine energy. She could be a Virgo. She's still keeping tabs on you and shit like that. What's crazy is I think she dating somebody. Ain't that weird? No, it ain't weird. It's how people be, all right? But most of y'all know, okay? Uh, or most of y'all know. I'm telling you, some of y'all, there is someone that you used to date, somebody who you used to work with, somebody uh, at your job currently that's keeping tabs on you. I told you that you're being monitored during this time. Girl, it's what they do. It's what they do. Spirit guys, what warning signs do uh, all fire signs need to hear during this time? Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. What warning signs do all fire signs even hear during this time, Father God? I don't know. You know, I just, you just heard me say Father God. <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay, so um, some of y'all might need to pray. You know, keep up with your prayer life during this time. Be careful that you're not slacking off whenever it comes to prayer because I don't, I haven't done that in a while. All right, so Page of Pentacles. Yo, I told you somebody watching your social media, kid. You look at it. All right, Page of Pentacles. Some of y'all, there's a cancer watching you. Cherry card is here, and the two of cups just came out. All right, but somebody here is watching your social media, monitoring you, watching you. It's some weird shit. Watching you like fucking TV. I don't know if some of y'all can be seen on the TV or something like that. Or some of y'all, like I said, your social media is being watched during this time. Some of y'all, it's a lover. Um, some of you guys are somebody who you used to work with, and you messed around with their ass. Uh, some of you guys, it's a literal supervisor that's watching your social media. Shit, they might, they might be a fan or they just, you know, being nosy and shit like that. <laughs> some of y'all also need to go ahead and be looking at cars during this time. Two of Swords and a Chariot car, you need to uh, start looking at cars during this time. Uh, some of y'all might need to start looking up different loans. Um, I say that because the King of Swords is here and that can represent uh, official officials. For me, it's most definitely a water sign. Okay, Queen of Cups and a Chariot card, men, women, whichever. You look at it. Okay, six, girl, you look at it. High Priestess with the Six of Cups mystic is what in the building. Some of you guys are picking up on energy from people from your past, people who you have walked away from. Eight of Swords, if you've been feeling... 
I be reading the fuck out these cards. Eight of Cups and the Eight of Swords. Anybody who you walked away from, um, kind of called it a quits with. Ace of Swords came out the rest. It's kind of like, nah, I'm off of you. All right? You picking up on these people's energy. All right? Some of these people could want uh, you to be confused. You did not know where you're going. Or they could feel that way of themselves. Be careful that you aren't absorbing people's energy who you have walked away from. Uh, some of y'all might need to start asking God, like, yo, keep me safe and protected from the enemies, okay? Y'all know how that shit go, all right? Get behind me. <laughs> Get me behind me. All right, uh, but some of y'all, shit. Some of y'all got some, uh, got it, uh, what, what, how it go? I got enemies, got a lot of enemies, got a lot of people trying to drain me of this energy. Trying to take away from... High priestesses, see, I told y'all, some of y'all know. Some of y'all know it. Some of y'all know certain people that's still keeping tabs on you. Some of y'all, this could be strangers. I just kind of feel like, um, who the fuck is you to be having all these people watching you, kid? All right, for real. Because you, it, the first card out is Page of Swords. That's why I said watch your environments as well. Some of y'all need to watch where you be going uh, at night. High priestess, okay? And you see it's kind of like night thing out there. Ain't this some shit here? Ain't this some shit here? Spirit guys, what warning of signs and their messages do all fire signs need to hear during this time? Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. What do they need to hear during this time, Spirit guys? Warning messages. Hermit card with the Eight of Cups. Um... Be careful that you aren't, I'm going to be real because I heard it. Be careful that you aren't falling into a depression. Uh, some of you guys might be spending a lot of time by yourself or just in the house in general. And I'm going to be real, your house might not be all, all together. All right, like it could be a little bit messy. You could be misplacing shit, forgetting shit and everything. Your energy kind of fucked up. All right, I had to sage this bitch out, light a few candles, do a few, okay, because I, I have not been feeling like myself. For the past few weeks, really, like really days, okay, uh, but I kind of, I felt the off energy, and now I know why, I see why, I see fucking why now, I told y'all know I'm a Leo, so we here, we see it, okay, ain't this not a bitch in my ghetto nut voice, alright, but some of y'all need to be careful about spending too much time in his house, uh, kind of not getting outside, enjoying fresh air, being cooped up, you could be falling into a depression, shorty. And you know just how they got functioning alcoholics, functioning uh, addicts. They have functioning uh, depression, okay? You can operate just fine, but, girl, you, we see it a lot more than we think, all right? Be mindful of that. Spirit guys, what warning uh, messages and their signs do all fire signs need to be aware of during this time? Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. You look at that. Okay, the intuition is on a fucking band, my guy. Okay, moon card. So the overall energy for y'all, uh, is it hot? Is it hot? No, girl. It's probably these candles, honey. Um, but moon card is the overall energy for this fucking morning reading, y'all. The enemies are everywhere. Girl, some of y'all got enemies you don't know. Enemies with people who you used to date. Enemies of people who people that you girl the enemies is everywhere like why why are they here? Moon card. I'm telling y'all some of y'all might have been feeling a little bit to yourself Not really been feeling all that motivated and shit like that moon the harmony card can be a little bit of a depressive uh Depressive, okay a little bit of a depression. All right It's not you also some of y'all your cycle could be coming up shorty I just seen the Queen of Cups moon card, and now we got the Empress on the bottom of the deck. Divine Feminine. Some of y'all, like I said, your intuition on the band. Some of y'all are empathic, uh, empathetic, empath. Empathetic, empath uh, sponges to where it's easy for you to soak up emotions around you. So it's important that you keep your energy and your space and your environment cleansed out. Sage that bitch out. Sage yourself. Please make sure you're saging yourself too. And like I said earlier, you need to make sure that you're keeping up with your prayer life, all right? Because, you know, he sees shit that you don't, right? So whenever you start feeling it, by that time it's too late because it's already been attached to you. All right, some of y'all need to make sure if you went to this spiritual shit, 
Know that bad energy is out here. I'm telling y'all. Some of y'all got people that you don't know watching you. All right, who kind of really ain't fond of you, but shit, they still watching you. So uh, they're fond, all right? Some of y'all got people who used to be friends with who are watching you. Six of Cups is here, kid. It's a lot of past energy right now that y'all are soaking up. Look at it. You look at it. And you look at it. Damn, I'm reading. Okay, high priestess. Eight of Swords and the Six of Cups. What I just say, impact, empathetic sponges, empath sponges. Some of y'all are absorbing energy from people from your past, people around you, all right? People who feel confused, and they want you to feel confused, too. Why is it that you waking up just making shit pop? Because that's what I do, all right? Nah, but uh, some of y'all, you got people around you like that, or people who you used to know who feel this way towards you, son. Oh, that was smoke. I'm like, what the fuck was that? And you look at that, my spiritual father, all right, higher fan. Like I said, keep, in, uh, keep up with your spiritual game, yo, because uh, shit gonna feel real off whenever you've been slacking with your spiritual practices, okay? I'm a big believer, and once you get into this spiritual walk and you're doing it, walk, <laughs> once you get into this spiritual walk and you're doing it consistently, all right, it's gonna be easy to tell whenever you start slacking because you're gonna be able to start picking up. As you can see, I've been, been slacking, okay? Apparently, because I've been feeling this way, yo, and I've been like, what the fuck been going on? You know what's crazy? There's only certain circumstances to where I can read for myself. I feel it's still because I'm still growing, all right? I can't read for myself, and I and I tell you, I've been trying to figure out what the fuck has been wrong with me, son. Why have you been being so lazy? You look at this shit. Why would I read for everybody else? I heard the answers come out. Check. All right. She got double up on the energy. Four and the eight of swords. Like I said, be aware of, uh, be aware of being lazy during this time. You never know. You could be picking up on energy outside of you. All right. Some of y'all, it could be a mother. Your mother, they mother, your grandmother. All right. Spirit guides. Give me some warning uh, messages and their signs. They're all fire signs need to be aware of during this time. Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Leo, you out here strong. Excuse me. Leo, you've been showing up. Aries, you've been showing up. I don't know where Sag be at. Whenever I do these readings, sometimes Sag just be in the back, okay? I don't know. They might be ahead of us, y'all, okay? Strength card, Leo energy. Some of y'all need to get outside, too. Uh, some of y'all could have been slacking on your workouts, okay? You need to get back outside because your bones is snap, crackle, pop, rice krispies, okay? Some of y'all might not be stretching like how you used to, and it's like, what's happening? Okay, girl, you can't slack off and still expect to, you know, be out here, you know, limber and shit like that. Come on, man. We're cats, but okay, cats get old. That is so funny. Uh, Page of Pentacles with the strength card. Um, well, it's, it's, it's down here. Um... Also, some of y'all need to make sure, uh, be careful about uh, online shopping at night. I kind of feel like it has something to do with the shipping, all right? Like, it might get there later on, or maybe you're just not in your best, uh, you're not in the best decision-making mode at night, okay? Just be careful about being bored and spending unnecessary money, yes? Um, this past energy keeps showing up, y'all. Six of Cups. There's someone, uh, someone or people, people. Mmm, damn. Fire signs. Ten of swords, page of wands with the six of cups here. Some of y'all have decided to terminate friendships, terminate relationships. It's just like, I'm done with the bitch, okay? Like, once I say I'm done, I'm done. I keep seeing it. People don't believe you serious until you serious. I've been in a few situations to where it's kind of like I've had to cut people off, kid, and I've already voiced my opinion on how I've been feeling, how i kind of been feeling like, you know what I'm saying, um, They've been fucking me over, right? And I, you know, I voiced my, my my opinion before. And here's the thing about me: my moon is in Libra, and I'm a Capricorn rising. So while I feel like I am very uh, overgiving at times, once I'm done with you, I'm done with you. All right, I like I. It's kind of like a it literally kind. It is sort of kind of like a switch for me. Because once I feel like I voice how I felt towards you and you kind of just like don't take it seriously, all right, now we done. All right, because now I I told you how I felt and you ain't did shit about it. Probably because you don't give a fuck or you don't think I'm serious. So nobody think you serious until you serious. I had to cut some people off and they was acting shocked at some shit like I, I told you how I felt, you know. You didn't give a fuck. So now here we are. Some of y'all, this is with friends, okay? Three of cups, uh, five of swords, people who 
Lord. Some of y'all, this is with family members. Ten of Cups. Ladies, y'all showing up. Queen of Wands. All right. Five of Swords and the Three of Cups. Some of y'all, uh, I don't know if you knew it or you found out and you did that Ten of Swords, double up on the Energy Five and the Ten of Swords. Some of y'all had friends who kind of felt like they had cooler friends or friends that they uh, connected with a little bit more. And that's fine. I feel like we all have different sort of uh, friend friendship levels. That's fine, but I kind of feel like they isolated you. Like, they kind of pushed you to the side because, you know, maybe there was a bigger crowd to gravitate to. Or maybe they just didn't feel like you would fit in with that other crowd. All right, fine. You have that crowd. Nobody thought that you was going to do that. Uh, five signs. Nobody thought that you was just going to break away from their ass. Like, okay, now nah, we're done. Because I told you how I felt. And you still didn't change. You didn't do nothing about it. So let me go ahead and do something about it. Goodbye. All right. Spirit guys, I do see a lot of loner energy out here for you fire signs. Spirit guys, give me uh, some warning messages that all fire signs need to hear during the sign. Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Fool card with the temperance card. Yeah, I am picking up a lot of loner energy. Hermit card and the fool card. Uh, the hermit and the fool is the same person for me. Uh, the hermit is when the fool is making too many risky decisions and he needs to sit down and get some wisdom. And the fool card is when the hermit has been in his shell for too long. Some of y'all might have a cancer placement. Um, yeah, some of y'all might have a, a cancer uh, placement. Because I just said shell. And I looked at this moon card and I was like, oh, they go cancer. All right. Some of y'all might also have moon uh, in a fire sign. All right. Um... Monitor, <laughs> monitor your moods. Pay the swords, hermit card, and the fool card. Like monitor whenever you see that you've been staying in the house too long. You kind of been staying to yourself for too long. Monitor how you've been feeling and what you've been doing uh, with yourself. Okay, you going you gonna start to realize, oh, I'm fucking my own shit up. All right, you know what I'm saying? Or with the fool card, monitor whenever you feel like you've been making too many risky decisions and not really uh, taking the time out to really think things through. And fucking my own shit up. Some of y'all are gonna find the balance and the moderation whenever you uh you know you isolate the problem. All right, it comes with discipline. World car. Some of y'all are really having to practice self discipline during this time. Men, I'm seeing this. Well, King and Queen and Wands that came out, but men, this could be heavily uh happening for y'all. But like I said, King and Queen of Wands just came out. World car and the higher fan. I'm gonna be real. Uh, he not gonna do everything for you, y'all. Temperance and the higher fan. Your spirit guys and God not gonna do everything for you, especially whenever it comes to shadow work. Some of y'all gotta figure out your own toxic ways. What are you not doing that's keeping you in a certain position? And you gotta get out of that. All right. It's kind of like we can show you the way, but it's up to you to really make your own decisions. The lovers card. Spirit guys, give me some warning uh, messages and signs that all fire signs need to be aware of during this time. Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Oh my God. Three of Swords. Okay. 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 All right. Some of y'all, oh Lord. Some of y'all could be dealing with a, a air sign or a water sign, and this person just breaking your heart, kid. Uh, three of swords. It's not funny. It's not funny. I, I apologize, y'all. It, it's just um, I don't know. Don't be playing uh silly games and expect not to get a silly prize. Some of y'all could be dealing with somebody who was like this person is showing you who they is time and time and again, and you keep dealing with their ass. And you keep asking yourself, why does this keep happening? Girl, you keep dealing with they fuck ass. I'm I'm confused. Some of y'all this could be with a water sign or an air sign. Libra is heavy here. Uh, Gemini is heavy here. Uh, water. Ace of Cups with the Moon card. Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. But I've only seen heavy. Uh, no, Six of Cups, uh, Ten of Cups, and the Two of Cups came out. So it can be uh, any uh, water sign. Star card. Yeah, some of y'all need to commit to spiritual healing, Queen of Cups, whenever you be feeling like everything is fucking up around me. Why? Okay, some of y'all, you know what I'm saying? You need to get on that spiritual shit. Start praying. Asking yourself, are you doing the necessary shadow work? Are you breaking out of habits that you know kind of don't serve you any good anymore? Okay, like, are you doing the actual work? Some of y'all might need to start asking yourself that. Spirit guys, what's going on with all... Give me some warning messages and their signs regarding all fire signs, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius that they need to hear during this time. Last card. 
Men, damn. Damn, men. Okay, King of Wands. Like I said, man, be uh, careful about still uh, dealing. Some of y'all could have a moon and a fire sign as well, and this is probably going to resonate because the moon card is the middle card for this reading. Yeah, I need to put that in the, uh, in the thumbnail. So some of y'all could have a moon and fire sign, and this is going to resonate as well. All right. Um, Ace of Wands and the Seven of Swords with the Four of Wands. Some of you guys need to be careful about uh, reigniting a certain situation with someone uh, who you could live with, you have lived with, you could have got this person pregnant. Be careful about involving yourself in a certain uh, situation to where it's kind of like you see seven of swords, three of swords, and the moon card. Maybe you done wrong, maybe they done wrong, but you you seen the issues with this, and you still you know deciding to you know get involved with this again. You play silly games, you will get silly prizes. The Justice card is here with the Five of Swords. Be careful about uh, still uh, being around certain people. Three of Cups are still being with someone out of ego. All right? Or kind of feeling like you, yeah, out of ego. Maybe you need to prove other people wrong. Maybe you want to prove yourself wrong. Okay? Like, girl, just get out of it. Okay? Some of y'all just need to get out of a certain uh, love connection with someone. Even if you have a child with this person on the way. Even if you have ch children with this person currently. It's either an air sign or a water sign, y'all. Libra is heavy out here. Aquarius and Gemini is heavy out here. Uh, and we got the water here. Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. Uh, be careful about being uh, foolish in certain situations during this time. Uh, also, be careful about spending your money foolishly, all right? Fool card, moon card, and the page of pentacles. Don't be making no risky moves with your money unless it comes with you investing in yourself, all right? Some of y'all need to watch uh, what you're investi uh, investing in during this time. Well, some of y'all might have a, uh, some, some jewelry around your ankle. Okay, Justice Card, you might be dealing with some sort of legal situation. Like I said, be, uh, be aware that you are being monitored uh, during this time. Five signs, that was y'all warning reading. Okay, Aries, Leo, and Sag. Remember, I am doing the warning readings for this kind of price at $25, which is money, love, and spiritual warning uh, messages. All right, in the reading. And I'm only doing this for a limited time only, so go ahead and book your spot before I, you know, cut this off. All right, please like the video. Leave a comment telling me if this resonated with you in any way. Subscribe to the channel. Check the description box for my uh, pricing information as well as my content information to book a personal tarot reading with me and all the spiritual businesses that I support will be in the pin comment in the comment section. All right, y'all. Let's go ahead and head up out of here because I got some other readings to do. All right. Bye, y'all. Did it stop? Shit.